Sellers are getting so much better at optimizing listings, images, and SEO. Sophisticated tools and AI is leveling the playing field. Will we see 2024 become a PPC battlefield? Ooh, I love that question. I think it's getting more and more competitive and it's about like mastery at every level. I think at the end of the day, honestly, I'm, I'm going to tell you this and you're going to hate the answer. People are getting good at main images and split testing main images and optimizing main images. People are getting good at the rest of the images, the videos, the premium A plus content. So creatives are getting good. SEO is getting good. PPC you have my Amazon guy, you have Trivium, you have 100 other agencies. They're all getting really good at systematically improving, identify keywords, and it's going to come down at the end of the day to product innovation. And that's what's going to happen. Once the playing field is level up, everyone has amazing creatives. Everyone has amazing ads. Everyone's showing up in all the right times. It's going to come down to, I sell an electrolyte product in an electrolyte category. Why should you buy mine? If I come up with the new, the better, the improved, that's what's going to be the swing. Obviously that and reviews, because at the end of the day, with all things being the same, these people are going to judge you based on your price and reviews and reviews. I think most of the times outweigh price because I'll pay like $5 more for a 35,000 review product versus 500. I think that right. See, to add on to that Amazon business, people spend so much time focusing on the Amazon that they forget about the second part of that, which is business, right? It's ultimately Amazon is just a vehicle to bring your products and services to more people. Right. That's all that Amazon does. Having a compelling, unique sales proposition, product people like at a price that's reasonable, is still always going to be your best way to high conversion and therefore to high ranking and their and good reviews and all the other things that Mina listed. So having a, a quality product, bringing a quality product that people find value in is really important as it always is and always has been in business. And then the other thing that I think is going to start to come into play now more is everybody gets so good on Amazon, the omni-channel strategies are gonna start to become more important. Like social media influencers, the TikTok attribution traffic, the D2C website, all those other ways, because the competition is getting more fierce, which means that you need to put your brand in front of people's eyeballs more times before they read and react on it. Some of that Amazon is just comparison shop, but in terms of the longer play of growing your brand awareness on Amazon and in the wider net, the wider world, even Amazon with some of their system tools, right? And AMC, AWS, right? All those things, they're starting to realize, whereas they used to have sort of an Apple strategy of closed market, they're starting to really reward sellers who bring in in off Amazon traffic. So that's the other thing that could be a differentiator for you if you're right competing against somebody who's like, man, have, like they already have great creative, great SEO, like how do I beat them? You might think of, are there other ways that I can grab cheap traffic and bring them to my page from places besides it?